Hello. We have a new chair. We have, no, it's the same chair, just the person sitting in it. Yeah. Jeff's not here today. Okay. Uh, one, two, three. Who sits? Well, right now, everybody's sitting because we've got three not here. Oh, okay. There you go. Official. Official. Okay. Uh, first order of business is Michelle Washman, 29 Hemlock Hollow Road, application for renewal of special permit for residence office involving cooking class for children, uh, Kidalicious LLC. Sign in. Please. Good evening, everyone. Uh, my name is Michelle Waxman. I live at 29 Hemlock Hollow Road here in Woodbridge. Uh, I own a cooking school called Kid Delicious LLC. Uh, it's been a year, um, tomorrow's going to be a year, that I got my special permit to operate my school out of my home kitchen. And I respectfully uh, request the renewal of that permit for four years. Uh, nothing has changed since last year. I um, usually hold one session on Sundays. Um, and um, following the beacher calendar, whenever there's a day off or a holiday, then I usually have also a session that day. So it's not that many sessions um, a week. Um, so it's basically one session uh, on Sundays uh, from 3 to 5. Uh, kids uh, from 8 to 12 years old. Um, and um, nothing else has changed uh, since the last year. People are, it's a drop off class. People come to my house, they drop off their kids. I have enough space uh, on my driveway for people to park so they're not uh, uh, generating any traffic uh, by parking on the street. Um, and um, pretty much uh, the same circumstances as uh, when I requested my original permit. Um, I don't know if you have any questions. How many kids are usually coming in each week? Uh, my, num my top number is eight. So it varies every, every week. Um, it could be between five and seven kids, or it could be a full session, but uh, no more than eight kids. And how's it going? It's going very well, Good. thank you. It's, it's been very fun. Good. Making money at least? Uh, you know, the first year is very challenging, <laughs> so I want to say that. Okay. But not losing any money either. That's always <clears throat> good. Yes. You've had no complaints from neighbors, I assume. No, I haven't had any complaints, and I don't know if you've gotten any complaints. There's no complaints that have been yeah. received in the office. Okay. Any other questions? Do you plan to increase the number of classes? Uh, not for now. I have little ones at home, and um, it's just I'm concentrating on them, and uh, it's just they're part of my lessons. So um, their schedule is very busy during the week. So for now, it's only weekends. Um, so it's nothing has has changed since last year. This is for a four-year extension, Alan, right? Yes. Any other questions? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, or anybody, oh, this was a, oh, this is a public hearing. Is there anybody else, anybody who wants to speak on this? Uh, thank you. Uh, we had an application referred, uh, Robert Leonard, 175 Amity Road, application for amendment, section 3.12.1, liquor establishment. Does this have to go to... It needs to go to the Council of Governors. Council before we can schedule a public right. hearing on it the same and because thing. this is such a tight time frame, I would recommend to you that you do that, um, you know, give us two months to get it to them. 
because they they meet like next week and I'm not sure if we can turn it around that quick to say that we could have a hearing in May on this so staff's recommendation is that you schedule a hearing for June on it so that okay. we have an adequate time frame to get it to them okay uh, do we need a motion on that you can do it by consensus consensus is it the consensus to two months two months it is uh, okay, that takes care of that. We're now in work session. Uh, Michelle Washman, uh, 29 Hamlack Road, application, the application for renewal of special permit. I'll make a motion sure. to, to uh, approve the uh, extension for four more years. Any discussion on it? I just have to ask Chris if I'm voting or not. You're yeah. all still voting because Larry was a few minutes. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's just an observer. <laughs> You're observed. I'm observed. Okay. Second the motion. All in favor? Aye. 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 All opposed? Unanimous. Uh, the Woodbridge Gas LLC, that is uh, next month. That's scheduled for hearing next for month. next month. Uh, and the uh, report on Scrog, anything? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, where do we stand on the marijuana re regulations? Um, we were waiting to get some comments back from town council, and it's been rather busy, so I don't. Okay. I haven't seen anything back yet. Mm -hmm. And then there was the co uh, correspondence received from Attorney John Nuff on behalf of Woodbridge Village Associates. This is, I gave a copy to yes. you in your packet, and they're requesting a special meeting to a meet with you. A special meeting? Well, a preliminary, you know, non-binding discussion. Oh, okay. We've had these before. Um, they're proposing yes. some amendments to the zoning regulations, and so they want to get some feedback from you as to, you know, where you are. Okay. We could do that during a regular meeting. Exactly. Why can't we do that during a regular meeting? You could do it during a regular meeting, whatever you're, you know, I, right now your, your unless, load is pretty light. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Unless somebody has some great desire to have a special meeting on this. We've had a few of them. Yes, I subject. understand. And uh, <clears throat> I think we can do with that anymore. They would like to meet with you sooner rather than later. So if you want to do a regular meeting, I don't know if you want to do it for your regular meeting in May, which would be on Tuesday. Um, we've moved that May meeting to Tuesday because of the elections being on Monday. Yeah. So, um, but that's your that's up to you guys. Do you expect that they're going to submit something in advance of that as to what those zoning regulation revisions may be? Terry and I have seen it, so they, um, we can check with them and make sure that they want to release that out. Oh, they have specific. They have they have specific ideas what they would like to do. Um, so I can just we can just check with them and you know I think it would be nice if we could get that yeah so if they can I can um, email that out to you you know sooner rather than later yeah okay everybody agree yes fine we'll put that down for the next so meeting. that would be the the Tuesday the first Tuesday in Tuesday May. correct so it's Tuesday instead of Monday mm -hmm. okay uh, the only thing we have left is approval of minutes oh boy we're gonna get out of here Okay, the first is the uh, special meeting February 23rd. Um, that was where all the various re proposed revision or Changes to the draft POCD were made. Uh, do I hear a motion to approve these minutes? So moved. Second. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Okay, next. Regular meeting on March 2nd, 2015. Yes, and so was I. No. I'll make a motion yeah. to approve the minutes as of March 2nd, okay. 2015. Uh -huh. Do I hear a second? Second. Okay. All in favor? 
Aye. All opposed? Abstentions? Abstain. Abstain. And then... Uh, the other ones I haven't sent out. Yeah, I, I didn't think I saw those. They're, it's a placeholder for me. Oh, okay. They're here. I just didn't get on. Fine. If that's the case, we don't have anything there. Uh, if there's no other business, will I hear a motion to adjourn? So moved. Second? Second. All in favor? <coughs> Anybody opposed? Forget about it. Could you note that we started on time today? <laughs> yeah.